What's up guys, this is Austin from Billetworks. Today we have a Focus ST. I'm gonna show you how to install your Billetworks Focus ST RS shift knob. Now that we're inside the car, I'm gonna show you how to install either our short teardrop or hybrid shape. Both function with a factory ST or RS reverse lockout with no modification or other parts. So first things first, I'm gonna remove the OEM shift knob, just simply thread it off. We're gonna reuse the OEM spring. We're gonna take our included flange nut, spin that on, flange side down. That's gonna allow a good surface for the spring to rest against. I like to thread it down until it's uh, just barely inside of the reverse lockout. Then we know we're not gonna have any clearance issues. And we can double check here, make sure when we pull up, we can go ahead and get it into reverse. So that function is okay. Next, we'll take our included insert, thread that on until it touches the flange nut. Then we're gonna take our 17 and our 19 millimeter wrench, and we're gonna lock the two together. Then we can either spin our short teardrop or hybrid knob, both with proper clearances for the OEM reverse lockout. So it stops and it's good to go. Now, if you have a shift knob from us that has an engraving on it, I'll show you how to properly align it. So we can see that it's maybe crooked about 45 degrees. So I'm gonna spin the shift knob back off and take our two wrenches. I'm gonna loosen up the insert and the jam nut. And I wanna remember which direction I needed the knob to rotate. So in this case, I needed to go clockwise about 45 degrees. So I'm gonna rotate that, lock the two together. I'll spin the shift knob back on. Now it's nice and straight. Now that I've finished the install video for our short teardrop, as well as our hybrid shape, you can go to our website, customize your shift knob, any color, engraving, emails, if you have any questions. Uh, this is our short teardrop and hybrid knob that will function with the OEM reverse lockout with no other parts or accessories.